Now, this is kind of cumbersome. Uh, you want to make sure that you add a frame and clip shape, content shape. Let's just create a brand new view modifier for this, which will make our lives much, much easier. So uh, right over here, maybe after the content view, let's just have a little bit more space. I'm going to create an uneven rounded corner modifier. So let's create a view modifier. And uh, I'm going to name this un uneven rounded corner modifier. Okay, so what we want is actually just pass along these radiuses, top leading, bottom leading radius, all of that stuff. So I'm just going to copy this out, uh, create it right over here, and it will be of type CG float. And let's duplicate this three more times. Now I'm just going to copy out the actual names. Bottom trailing is next, and then top trailing is final. And then we want to also add the style. Let's just add that as the last one, style. That is going to be a rounded corner style. There we go. And finally, what we want to do is just create our custom initializer for this. I'm just going to go with the suggested ones, but what I'm going to add is default values. So uh, we don't have to type this over and over again if we don't want to. So default values would be zero. Uh, on the actual uneven rounded rectangle, that's also uh, the default value. So zero over there and zero over there. And for the style, let's just go for the circle uh, continuous. Okay.